the architect of Pleasant Home, was George Washington Muir. Throughout his career, he encouraged other architects to develop an indigenous style based upon local conditions. Muir wrote about the need for a new American architecture. His work was aligned with the progressive architects in Chicago, now known as the Prairie School. Muir and his contemporaries embraced many of the ideas of the arts and crafts movement, which include truth to materials, a belief in fine craftsmanship, and the desire to incorporate the local environment into their building projects. Mayer's repeating decorative motif patterns consisted of native plants combined with geometric shapes. The commission from John Farson for Pleasant Home marked a new period in Mayer's work, a series of grand houses set on large estates, often enhanced by the Midwest's best artists and craftsmen. Pleasant Home and the Frederick Gates House in Montclair, New Jersey, are the only surviving examples on this opulent scale. Pleasant Home is considered one of the earliest and most distinguished examples of prairie school architecture in the nation. It is operated by the Pleasant Home Foundation as a museum. Mm -hmm.